It is so good to see you. Oh, this is the first, like, in-person thing I've done, really, like, on TV, other than the Golden Globes. <laughs> that, you know how that went. So um, You guys want to go out for it. Yeah, we want to go out for the Globes. <laughs> um, but... Uh, Are you happy to be back in, in, in the world of business and, and getting to you, work again? Thank you, Seth. I'm back to work. Um, You're back to work. I mean, we had a year or two. Um, was it two years? Isn't it a little weird that there's been two, it's happened, March happened again? Yeah. It feels like we've had about a year and a half yep. of discovering what we care about. Um, tr you know, tough times, ma making bread, being creative in our sweatpants, but it's time to get back to work. I'm back in the office. You're back in the office. This, you know, you are one of my top work friends. You're like in my top 20 work friends. Of all time or currently? Just in New York. <laughs> okay. And, um, <laughs> So I'm excited about making sure that this is very productive because I need us to get. I'm going to bill you for this time. Okay, gotcha. So yeah. this is you don't. This is not about. We should not be frivolous. In I don't our want time any here. personal questions. <laughs> I don't want to get personal. But this isn't a time to talk about life. Just work. Just work. Productivity. Okay. Uh, numbers. If we find a way to get the sales up, the numbers that up. Our company is going to do. We need to make sure. So it seems like you've maybe gone back to a different kind of work that you were doing before yeah, because I, you don't seem very like locked in on the term. Yeah, I don't. I forget what <laughs> how work goes. <laughs> but um, I'm very excited to talk with you about solutions and ideas. Oh God, that would be great to find some solutions. Yeah. I do um, want to ask this because it is very nice having you back in New York City. Yeah. Uh, summertime in New York City. Are you pro? Are you con? Love summertime in New York okay. City. Okay. My favorite city in the world. Love being here always. Um, a lot of people are complaining about a lot of stuff in New York right now. But you know what I love? Construction. How so? Because I love construction sites. Because I do very well there. <laughs> really? Yeah. Historically, has this been? Yeah, a, they're my people. They're, that, that's, always, that's my group. That's, okay. my, that's my group. Gotcha. Like, if I see scaffolding, I'm like, what's going on over there? <laughs> oh, you won't go out of and your I way? And I go out of my way. <laughs> Just to say, what are you guys doing? Gotcha. Yeah, because I don't think that um, construction workers are big fans of Parks and Rec, but they are fans of my work. Oh, you that's great. I mean? Yeah, yeah. They're fans of my work. <laughs> and what's, this, how would, uh, what's a, a, a common way that they would let you know that? Well, no, I mean, I do like that everyone is out and about and talking and seeing each other again. And like, it is really great to make eye con contact with people. And what's great about New York is that. You can walk down the street and someone can be like, hey, beautiful. And you can be like, hi. And they can be like, can I ask you a question? And you're like, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't ask me a question. Right. It's that kind of give and take. Yes, like that you can immediately, it can immediately take a left turn into this is you've overstayed your welcome with even your second sentence. It's the best city in the world to keep moving. I, yeah. it's, it's the best. It's the best place in the world. It is the best place in the world. Yeah. It's kind of can be impressively hot. But you yeah. never minded that. No, and also I was here during the World Cup, which was awesome. How was walking that? around, oh, it was so great. I mean, just walking around the streets, Were watching. Were you rooting? Did you have a rooting interest I, in the final? I, I, I didn't. I, I, I was rooting for a good game, which is certainly what we got. Yeah. And Italians and the English, the Brits were like in full force in the bars and pubs all over the city. Um, and I love little little Prince George in his little suit. Yeah. I read, a, I read a headline in People Magazine that he's like, no more shorts, little. He's not crazy. wearing shorts? No, because he's eight now. It said he's eight. <gasps> and there was a big exclamation point. Like, this is final. No more no shorts? No more shorts. The, get, get used to the little suit look. He's not going to do well at construction sites. <laughs> <laughs> you got to wear shorts. You got to wear shorts. <laughs> but uh, I, it was exciting that Italy won. Yeah. There were so many scooters. In, in the West Village, just going like beep beep, like just very, like, there's a lot of people in like handsome suits and brown shoes being like beep beep, we won, beep beep. Hey! <laughs> like carrying raviolis and being like, we won! And then their beautiful girlfriend being like beep beep. Um, but that was great. I liked, I liked the, did you watch the World Cup? Uh, the European Cup, yeah. I mean, oh, excuse we get me. a lot of, we have this thing on the show now where people. Wait, that was the European Cup? Yeah. Oh my God! I thought it was the World Cup. It was the European Cup. Yeah, it was the European Cup. I thought um, it was the World Cup because the Olympics are coming up, so I got confused. Are you excited about the Olympics? Very excited. I know. I know some people don't like the Olympics, and whatever they say about it, I agree with that too. <laughs> but um, <laughs> but I do enjoy. I'm very sad that we're not going to see Shikari Richardson. Yeah. I think she's awesome and an incredible athlete, and I love watching her run. And. Are you surprised? Do you, uh, how do you feel about this rule? Well, I am impressed 
by the fact that she could do anything after smoking weed because I I could do very little. I see. Yeah, because she she continued to uh, yeah. excel. Yeah. Now you spent some time in Amsterdam, so I'm sure you had a minute or two where you tried a marijuana cigarette. Yeah, it never was. It wasn't. I it just wasn't get really real thing. tired. Tired. Yeah, I get real tired. I so like. You don't it. run. You don't sprint after that. No, no, no. Okay. But I would. I mean, uh, I would like to go see a film. Like if it was, you know, I. I well, that uh, did happen to me one time, but I will tell you that I, I, I. Uh, had a puff of a marijuana cigarette, uh -huh. and then I went to see I Am Legend. Okay, the, I the Will recommend Smith. It. Yeah, yeah, that was a movie with Will Smith. He was the only person left in New York. A dog is introduced very early on. You know the dog's not gonna. <laughs> <laughs> the dog's not You're not gonna be like this. You're not gonna make it to the end credits. The dog's yeah. not gonna make it. Then. What gets the What gets the dog? Is it like a vampire person or something? Oh yeah, probably some kind of like creepy alien that's never explained or right, right. like hey, a, I got a I got a question I though. I got a I am legend question for you. Yeah, of course. I'm ready. I run the website. Um no, but it's a hypothetical. All right. You're the last person in New York. Mm. What do you do? It's so funny you say that. My kid just asked me that really? question. He was like, "What if you were the only person here? What would you do?" And and I was like, it was like walk around the Met, like, I don't know. It yeah. would be a day, and then I would have a full uh, Right, well, because what I like about New York is there's a, you're surrounded by people who are very good at doing things that you can then benefit from. Yeah, like, am I going to make my own pizza? <laughs> no. <laughs> what? <laughs> Go into the best pizza place and make my own pizza? Like, right. no. Like, I'm not, I mean, I've watched a thousand times somebody mm -hmm. at a bodega make uh, my egg and cheese sandwich. Yeah. It doesn't I, mean I'm going to be able to do it. No. I think you and I both have a, a, a quality where we know what we're good at. Yeah. And it's not any of those things you said. Well, I think it will be heartbreaking to think of how uh, little improv uh, skills would come in handy. Oh, my God. Can you imagine? To, to imagine the only thing sadder than trying to do an improv show with people around would be like doing a bringer show when there's nobody around. You know what I would do? I'd go into one of those like cool mirror, you know, like those mirrors that sh look like there's 10 people and yeah. I do an improv show with myself. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm very hungover. Oh, yeah, that's right, because you drank. Because I did day drinking. We haven't aired it yet. We're going to air it next week. And, uh, and we, I mean, what is, would, back in the day when you were here, what is a, a perfect uh, hungover New York day for Amy Fuller? <sighs> wow. Well, this is pre-kids, of course, because you, you just, like, there's no way to be hungover once you no. have kids. Like, you just... You try to avoid it. Like, I mean, like, at yeah. some point, you're like, I don't even want to drink it. Yeah, with the you thought can't of even it. say you're hungover. You just are like, yeah. nope, I'm not. I'm just throwing up because I'm so happy. <laughs> um, but, uh, uh, <laughs> you know, the things that you, I used to use to cure my hangover are both gone, because I would, I would sit in Pizzeria Uno and read magazines. <laughs> Both Pizza Uno Pizzeria and the Mac Uno. I mean, maybe Pizza Uno is still around, and yeah. and you know, I'm sure they're celebrating Italy's European Cup <laughs> win. <laughs> I mean, they're not going crazy. I mean, I can't, I'm, I'm like reeling that I thought it was the World Cup. I just didn't read the fine print. That's fine, but I mean, it was two European. Uh, I mean, those teams could have been in the final of a World Cup too. So I feel yeah. like a couple guys told me it was the World Cup. <laughs> Well, it was were at they the construction bar. guys? They were construction guys. They were like, hey! Were they like, hey, they you like, just won the World Cup! They were like, you got the World Cup of, you know what I mean. <laughs> and I was like, okay, oh my God, thank you so much, stop. Um, but yeah, what did you do for your hangovers? Um, I, what are you doing for your hangover today? I, well, it was like the, having a work got in the way of it a little bit, but I definitely want to have, like, I would like to have a very cold beer mm. and a very greasy hamburger. I think that would be yes. like what I would like. Yeah. That, that might be how I try to button mm -hmm. uh, this evening. And you drink the beer and throw, stick throw the it. hamburger down your pants. <laughs> and then I move around a throw lot. Throw the beer over your shoulder. <laughs> in the seat. Stick the hamburger down your pants.